Adrian, obviously you had a really impressive win over Perth on the weekend. A um, bit of time to sort of dissect it. What did you make of that game? Yeah, I thought it was a positive result, obviously. Um, still some things that we need to tidy up. Um, wasn't a 90 minute performance and we're still conceding goals. So we probably need to have a look at that. But it was uh, really positive to create a, a large number of chances and, and finish off quite a few. So we've got confidence that we can score goals, get positive results um, and you know, be strong defensively, even though that is an area that we still need to improve. Is that been the focus for this week? Just trying to be a bit tighter defensively, a bit more resolute, and, and don't concede those like uh, soft goals that you've spoken about in the past. Yeah, it's always a focus. It's a weekly focus, something that we we tend to work on. Um, but uh, actually, this week we've spent a lot of time focusing on our on our finishing and our crossing and our, our final third actions. So um, yeah, there's always lots to work on every week, um, and defending will be something that we continue to focus on throughout the season. What have you made of Canberra's start to the season? Obviously, they're still searching for their first win. We've played them uh, about a month ago as well, and collected that win. Um, is this a bit of a danger game because you feel like there's a lot on the line for them? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it was a really close game at, at Martin when we played Canberra in round two. Um, they gave us a, a really, really great game. They're a tough side to play against. We haven't got the best record in, in Canberra uh, as a club over the journey. So it's going to be a really difficult place to go play and try and get a result, but we're confident that um, we've got a good game plan and we're confident in the players we're taking over. Um, and if we can make the most of the, the key moments in the game, um, hopefully the result will, will be a positive one. And also four games into the season now, what's your overall assessment with the two wins and two defeats? Yeah, it's been a bit like that. Um, there's been a bit up and down. Um, there's been some real positives that with so many new players and, and such a new group, it's been pleasing to see, but there's also been some moments where we just haven't been good enough as well. Um, so it's about trying to minimise those moments within games and, and week by week uh, and maximise um, our strengths. And we're really hoping to try and get on a bit of a consistent role uh, and string some, some good results and good performances together. And just finally, from like a personnel perspective, how's uh, Isabel Hodgson tracking? Obviously she's been out last two games. Is there anyone else that that uh, may be available as well, that hasn't played yet? Yeah, we'll bring Izzy to Canberra. She was close to playing last week. Uh, we feel confident that she'll be able to, to play some role in the match this week. I'm not 100% sure what that will be yet. Um, and apart from a, a couple of players, everyone's fully fit and available for selection. So it was a really challenging week for me, selecting the side. We've got a lot of players who are currently out of the squad, knocking on the door and training really well, putting pressure on those within the squad. So. Um, the players that have been selected will need to perform because if not, then there's an opportunity for others to come in.